A father and son are facing attempted murder charges after Greenville police say they stabbed three people at a downtown bar. Police say Russell Roth on the left and Eric Roth on the right are each facing three counts of attempted murder after being accused of stabbing three people near Sharkey's Pub. 7 News reporter Katie Salt talked to people in the downtown area today and wanted to know how safe they feel while walking the streets. Jenna Brooks and Trey Stripling had just wrapped up a night with friends in downtown Greenville. On their way home, they got a shocking text message. After we left, I got a message from my friend that there had been a stabbing downtown. It was really scary. You know, I was glad that we decided not to go, but it was just like a last minute decision to not walk around. So it was, we were this close to being in that area. Police say Eric and Russell Roth were walking near Sharky's Pub just before midnight when they got into a fight with three people and stabbed them. Officials say two of the victims are still in the hospital. I thought to myself, oh wow, like that is an event that if I were downtown leaving from dinner, walking down the street, you could easily, um, you know, be affected by that event. Police say the Roths were found in the Richardson Street garage and the knife they used was found somewhere in downtown. But police credit the extra officers in the downtown area last night with quickly containing the crime scene and finding their suspects. I'd say the police presence is along Main Street, um, Carolina L, you have some up by the Hyatt, down by Falls Park. So they try to place themselves at you know good points throughout the Main Street area. The Greenville Police Department says they always have extra officers downtown on the weekends when they know there will be bigger crowds out enjoying the area. While some, like Erica Caldwell, think downtown is already safe for others, seeing the extra police is a step in the right direction. I feel like downtown is pretty secure. Um, I've never had an incident where I've been downtown and felt unsafe. So I feel like the police are doing their job. Their presence is here. It's, it's scary to think about because it's it's hard to know who's going to do what when you're walking around the street at mm -hmm. night. And like, and even if they have like five or six extra police officers, it's they're not monitoring every single person who's walking down the street. It's still just unsettling to know that this is happening in our town, something so violent. Um, but it is nice to hear that they are making an effort to make it safer down here. In Greenville, Katie Soul, 7 News. And a judge set bond for both Eric and Russell Roth at $60,000. According to the Detention Center website, Russell bonded out. Also in Greenville, Katie